Well, for a long time, he's been mentioned with the baddest men on the planet. For a long time, though, the title fight eluded him. Not anymore. Here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, finally making this walk and cracking a smile. He's waited a long time for this. He's not expecting a 25-minute war. He believes he has the power and the skills to get this thing done quickly. I guess we'll find out. This has been the baddest man on the planet now for several years, and he has taken on all comers more often than not, leaving them twitching on the canvas, knockout power for days. The question is tonight, with a challenge like this, can he walk out the way he came in as the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world? Let's get you our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Both fighters are 31. Adesanya is nine inches taller. He will have an eight inch reach advantage. All right, now for the official introductions, the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. Now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA. Introducing the challenger, Bruce the Dragon Lee. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 21 wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed USC heavyweight champion of the world, Israel the last style bender on a side. Yeah. All right, this is for the UFC Championship. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, come back to your corners, come out fight. They touch him up, and we are underway. Well, these guys have been on each other's radars for quite some time. Tonight, it shall be done. Both guys well-rounded. You think we're getting a kickboxing match tonight or what? You just don't know, right? You don't know who's going to be able to employ their strategy the way that they need to. This is a close fight on paper, and also in every performance we have seen them put on. These guys seem to be the mirror image of each other. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Well, we talked about that reach advantage as you see him land the straight punch there. Great job using his length in that situation. Right punches there. So both guys landing it well here. Good action early. Lee gets hit with a kick. Well, it didn't take him long to get a good read on his opponent. Another good series of kicks there. He thought the kicks would be the key tonight. 
and they sure have been. Beautiful punch. Trying to hammer that lead leg. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, beautiful strike there by Israel Adesanya. He's got a lifetime in the game, not a lifetime in the UFC, but you see, this is a lifelong striker who is very dangerous with all those. Yeah, and when you're standing with Izzy, you're in trouble, man. You're under constant attack the whole time because you never know what he's going to hit you with. And right there, he lands the strike that he was looking for. 27 total strikes have now landed for the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. Oh, and he tags him with the straight, beautifully placed there by Adesanya. Good punch, Lance. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Some nice back and forth action here. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Under three minutes remain in round one. Hands higher, hands higher. Oh, collar tie. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Looking to land the leg kick now. Body shot there. And he landed the right hand there. All right, so he lands another jab now, just snapping that thing off, DC. I believe that the jab was lost in mixed martial arts initially, but now it has been found, and it's been found by this young man in this octagon tonight. Adesanya circling to his right. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. Under two minutes now to go in the opening round. Big punch lands over. No! Oh, huge right hand! Oh, he's hurt bad. Whoa! He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Win the scramble. Oh, he's got the knee on the belly. Could be trouble defensively. Uh, working out of side control here. His opponent trying to control posture, but you gotta be careful here. Well, these are some excellent ground and pound strikes here, DC. There's an efficiency with which he operates in these situations. He knows exactly when to throw, exactly when to hold, and it's allowing him to really control the grappling aspect of the fight. There's a song there, right? Know when to hold him, know when, when to hold him. Yeah, absolutely. Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Nice job to land the knee there by the taller fighter, and I think I just heard Daniel Cormier say, I wish I was a little bit taller. We're a baller, though. Adesanya gets crushed with that hook. 45 seconds remain in the round. What a punch. Wow! He's a trouble. He's hurt bad. Nice shot to the body there. Oh! oh unbelievable. Back to the feet. Both guys landing with conviction now. Oh! Nice high kick. Good punch. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Horn out for the end of round one. All right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of there. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands, his opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent's staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. Okay, you ready, round two? Ready? Nice punch there by Lee. Nice head kick. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. He is getting lit up right now, John. 
game of inches right there, oh, boy. Yeah. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Misses again with a right punch. Right hand on point. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. There's the swing and there's the miss by Adesanya. Nice head kick. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes him stop throwing. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Nice loop and punch. Pinpoint accuracy on the kick there by Adesanya. It's just hard to know what's coming, and there's no stopping this. I mean, there's no stopping. There's no tell. He's just at a different... Oh! Straight right. What a tricky head kick. Just over three minutes to go. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick. And all I can think of, better him than me. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one. And now starting to find himself in the pocket. Well, no surprises, he connects once again, and that looked like it landed right on that cut. Right on the cut, and he's targeting it, right? He's looking, you can see him almost putting a laser beat on that cut and just putting his hands on it. It doesn't take much, he's just keep making it split, showing his opponent that he has no mercy. And he switches his stance yet again. Big body kick man. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block! And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect, so fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land from anywhere. Well, you gotta think he's happy with this performance here tonight. Essentially, just the way he drew it up, it's been a striking claim. It's like a fairy tale. He's doing everything he wanted to do, and his opponent isn't doing much to try and deter him and really mess with the game plan. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Kick to the body now, that one won't land. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press it. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Oh, straight right. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not... Oh! Strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent wholly saw it coming. And before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. So the celebration is on for the UFC heavyweight champion of the world, the baddest man on the planet, and your winner, yes, by knockout here tonight.